Absolutely. The hit musical Annie has been around the world for decades and has finally come to South Africa. But this show is not what you would expect from the classic play. In fact, uh, from new dynamic elements that are being added to the multiple layers on the story being told, this remake is sure to have audiences on the edge of their seats. And from the play, we have three Annies, Caitlin, Leela and Emma Rose, as well as Niels Klaassen. Good morning to you guys. Hi. The energy has just been crazy as soon as you rocked up on set. Man. Is this what it's like? when you guys are rehearsing when you're working together on stage? All the time. Yeah. <laughs> yep. yeah. Pretty much. We, we even did like a laughing pose. Just show everyone one, two, three what your laughing pose is like. <laughs> I don't know, it's weird, but it's cool. Uh, Niels, let me yeah. start off with you. I mean, you, you're very well known on South African uh, theatre stages, having played in Mamma Mia, We Will Rock You. What was it like and how did it compare uh, being part of the cast of Annie? Look, I mean, first of all, I, I, it, it still feels strange that I'm Daddy Warbuck, so that, that was always a, a, a challenge in my head. Am I old enough? Am I that guy now? <laughs> uh, but <laughs> but uh, in comparison, beautiful. I, it's a lovely role, but it, it's lovely being surrounded by, by this beautiful young energy. And <laughs> all these kids are so incredibly professional. The, the show is so dynamic and so new. The, yeah. It's been reimagined and redesigned and the choreography blows your mind. So literally, it's a privilege to be part of something that is larger than life and truly amazing. And I remember I was traveling to Johannesburg and I was at my hotel room and they had a screen that showed the audition process and your faces came up and it turns out that after hundreds and perhaps even thousands of auditions of uh, girls that wanted to play Annie, you were the three that were chosen. So, <laughs> Caitlin, what is it like to feel, or how does it feel to you to be one of the very special three that have been chosen out of everyone who wanted to be Annie? It feels amazing. I mean, I mean I'm, I'm at such a young age still and to be able to be a lead that for some people takes years is incredible and I mean this role is such an incredible role and yeah. it's, it's such a humbling role and, and her like character and personality is so great to play. Yeah. It, it's really amazing. And Leela being the smallest of the three <laughs> of you, is it, is it in, <laughs> your laugh is contagious. <laughs> um, is it intimidating being on this big stage playing alongside all of these actors? Um, well it's, I'd say it's more comforting having people around because like having cast members and also like when Niels is on stage, you don't get nervous. Because there's always people like behind you, you're never alone on stage, which is one of the nice things. Yeah. And Emma Rose, how, I mean, you, all three of you play the character of Annie. Does it, does it make it a bit easier to know that you've got a friend there who's, you know, who might help you with a line or two here and there when you struggle? Yep. Yeah, well... It's definitely easier when you don't know exactly what's right. You can always ask a friend. I have two. <laughs> um, but I think that all of our, like, we all portray Annie differently. We all have the basics. We're all feisty and a mother figure to all the orphans. Yes. But it's the little things that we do differently that makes mm. our performance so completely different. No words. Spoken like a true professional. Oh, Bravo no. already, <laughs> yes. Standing ovation, standing ovation. Um, listen, I want to ask all three of you, what, what is your favourite part of the play? So that, that when people watch you on stage and you're playing Annie at that particular time, they must know that is your favourite part of it. I will start off with you, Caitlin. Well, that's a tough one because, I mean, I love every single scene in that show. But um, when it comes to a scene that I'm involved in and love doing, I love um, performing in Hard Knock Life. Uh -huh. it's, it's like the, it's the performance that starts the show. It really gets the energy up and, you know, it's, it's, such, a great, um, chore it's such a great choreography. And, I mean, the song is so catchy. So, I mean, it's, absolutely, it's the Absolutely, absolutely. Lila, what about you? Um, I think it's probably NYC. Um, because like the whole company's involved and there's so many different things going on and there's this amazing tap break in the mm -hmm. middle of the song and it's just a really special number. Sounds really cool, Emma. Well, for me, it's I Don't Need Anything But You, which I share with Niels. And I just think that the, so, so, the song is so upbeat yeah. and vibey and it has such a good message and the choreography is absolutely fantastic. My word. Because I'm in it. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you break it down, you break it down. Yes, I'm hot. Hot. Yes, yeah, like a true gentleman, Niels. <laughs> Girls, Niels, thank you so much for being here this morning. And uh, I wish you all of the best with the run of Anya. I hope that it draws in thousands and thousands of crowds and that we will go out there and support, of course, our local talent. And of course, be sure to catch Annie. Uh, it's going to be on at the Artscape Theatre until the 8th of January 2017. And then also stay tuned because we have a fun little competition coming your way where you could win tickets to the show.